Talk a little weather. Leah Pizzetti in for Leah tonight and uh, we talk football and it's always a great time of the year because uh, we know the shift in temperatures is coming uh, pretty soon, but not this week, right? We're still talking the hundreds. We're a little cooler than we've been the past couple weeks, but yeah, still technically in those hundreds. Taking a live look, multiple parts of California. You can see Bakersfield, Tehachapi, San Diego, clear blue skies. Lake Tahoe has some cloud coverage going on right now. We can see that right here on Storm Shield Doppler. You can see a little bit of action going on up north, but down here, down south, nice and clear. That's what we're going to be seeing most of this week. Clear blue skies. Ah, oh, take a look at that. You can't complain. We are at 99 degrees right now. We did hit 100 earlier today, though, meaning our heat wave does continue, breaking down your next five hours, cooling on down, hitting the 80s at 9 p.m. tonight. And taking a look at your highs for tomorrow, pretty similar to what we felt today. We're in those upper 90s, lower 100s range for the Valley. Bakersfield 100 degrees, as I said, Wasco and McFarland both at 98 degrees, along with Taft. And in our mountain communities, Pine Mountain Clubs looking at 79 degrees for tomorrow. Fraser Park 82, Tehachapi 87 degrees, Lake Isabella 94 degrees for tomorrow. And in our desert communities, right, same thing as the Valley. We're looking at those upper 90s, lower 100s for tomorrow with a little bit of a breeze. Breaking down your day for tomorrow, as I said, we're at 90 degrees right now. Pretty similar to what we're going to be feeling in the afternoon, peaking at 100 for tomorrow and our air quality will be moderate, a little bit better than what we've been seeing. We're having pretty good air quality. Breaking down your next seven days. Look at this 100 for tomorrow and pretty similar the next couple days. A lot of zeros on there, so no big jumps, no big dips. Pretty boring if you ask me, but you know what? Not so boring. We have a heat wave, so this one started on Friday. This is heat wave number four of the summer. Today we did hit that 100 and as you just saw, those those next seven days looking at 100s again. So we could see a heat wave of uh maybe 10 days heat wave number four of the summer. Kern River Valley is looking at 94 degrees for tomorrow in those upper 90s through the week to Hatchaby. We'll see 87 in those upper 80s for most of the week. Fraser Park in those lower 80s as well. So pretty clear. Nothing too crazy. No big winds, no storms or anything that we're looking out for. Should be a good week. Coast through August, hopefully without uh, some in those extreme temperatures. So we'll just keep it here. That'd be nice. Yeah. All right, Lee, thanks for that. Neighbors, Saving a little dog.